Here's the four types I've made. All super simple. Start with the cardboard box cookers. Single piece of cardboard cooker. Just tape on the aluminum foil. Set it up in a half circle. This is the parabolic trough cooker. Just the cardboard and aluminum foil. And this is the dish cooker. With the poster board added. And add the aluminum. And here's a quick side by side with a professional dish. I modeled mine after that one, both three feet in diameter. All right, there's the focal point of the parabolic trough. All right, and here I am just messing around with the black bottle. I want to see if it melts it and how fast. Super fast, only took seconds. Here's some shots of the dish cooker. Focal point. And here's what it can do. Super powerful, as you can see. Steaks, chops, eggs, soups and sauces, everything. And for fun, whoa, instant fire on that one. Turned it into a torch right away. And here's some more detail on the solar box cookers temp range. You can see three pans easily fit inside of there. And here it is on a swivel. Makes it easy to move. And finally some detail on the single box one. Set up like that for max temps. Let's take a look and see what kind of temperature we got here. That's about 210 to 215. It's almost exactly what I thought I'd get. That's awesome. So there it is, single box, uh, covered in three long sheets of aluminum foil, bend it in a semicircle, point it towards the sun, and use this pot in pot design. You can set it up like this too with the four individual pieces of cardboard covered in tin foil, like this. Totally optional though, same temps, about 200 to 225 Fahrenheit. And that's the cookers. Super easy to make. Most expensive one was like $7 and that's the one with the glass. The other ones are like 5 bucks and under.